Hello everybody, welcome to another Vendetta Gaming video. <clears throat> Today we're going to be reviewing a very special mod. This time, it's the Billand mod. Basically, what this mod adds is LEGO! Yes, just the same toy you play with in your childhood. Let's go on a trip down memory lane. Well, maybe not for all of you. Anyway, let's get on with the mod review. I'm here in my workshop on the upstairs floor, as you can see. In, in our last mod review, we were testing... Um, over there we have some... I think we have some glitchy cars here. Oh yeah, there's a catering. Anyway. Let's go back upstairs into our workshop. Let's keep testing. Alright, so. What, what you're going to need to obtain the Lego is a bill and order for. Now the way you can do that, you can't craft it. You need to kill little baby villagers and zombies. That's what apparently I heard. Anyway, so as you can see in here I have a bunch of villagers. I'm sorry, this might just be... No. Oh, I'm... I'm not a omni hole. Yay! Die! I really hope I get some. Ah, come on, die! Okay. Let's just say they dropped an order form. Oh yay, we have an order form! So, the order form looks like this. When we right, right click it, we get this little cool little Lego style GUI. And then we, so there are five packs. The starter pack, the color pack A, color pack B, color pack C, and color pack D. Now, in my opinion, I think the starter pack is probably the best value because you get different colors, not like, a certain set of colors and you'll you get a good variety anyway as you can see there's a cost here so let me grab emeralds so see now I have, that's how many emeralds I have that's how many emeralds I need so I can get all these packs and I don't want to get all of them but let's let's buy the starter pack now we wait outside as you can see hold on let's just go head outside for just a moment. We'll start to see like an airdrop. So it's a, it's an entity that'll fall down. It's like a chest with a parachute. Oh, hold on. I think that's it. Yay. Let's just fall. Oh, hang on. Let's find it. There it is. So that's what the airdrop looks like. As you can see, so you can't actually open it in the air. It's... um. It's still an entity, so we've got to wait for it to get to the ground. As you, it looks like a chest with a parachute. It looks really cool. So, basically, wherever we stand outside, it'll eventually teleport to us. Okay, come on. There you go. Yay. And this mod's very good for role-playing or if, like, yeah, role-playing if you have, like, kids in the role-play and having fun. Anyway, let's just... There you go. Yay. Yay! So now that's turned into a chest and we can open it. As you can see, these are the bill and bricks. Now, let's just grab a couple green ones, blue ones, yellow ones. There we go. Let's grab a bunch of these bricks. Okay, so let's build. So we can go. Let's use, so basically, when you hold the villain bricks, you'll see it shows up where it's going to place it. So let's build like a little mini house. Uh, let's use... Build some walls or something. No! Let's delete that. So yeah, you just left click and delete it like that. So so you see the little hitbox and you can delete. Let's just build a little 
This is a really d derpy home. Let's build up. No. Let's continue. Okay. Block that right there. So as you can see, I think you get the gist of it. Um, this is actually a very cool mod. It's by the same person who made the computer craft mod. The mod where you can program and build and make, have your own computers. This is the derpiest house I've ever built with Lego, I have to admit. Very derpy. Um, let's go like that. Hello. Okay, let's grab the little bits. And then let's go. There we go. For some reason it doesn't want to place a different way, that's unusual. Anyway, so you guys can get the gist of the Lego mod. Um, as I said, it is a very cool mod. It is available for download for 1.6.4. I'll make I'll make sure to put the link in the description. Anyway, so thank you for watching this Vendetta.